here is a collection of gallstones. The presence of gallstones in the gallbladder and or bile ducts or biliary tree is referred to as cholelithiasis. This condition is common in the West, occurring in between 10 and 20% of all adults. It is rare in developing countries. In 70% of cases, cholelithiasis is symptomless. The gallstones are predominantly cholesterol stones, but a smaller proportion are pigment stones. Some stones are mixed cholesterol and pigment stones, and a small minority are calcium carbonate stones. Approximately 80% of gallstones are cholesterol stones, and around 20% of adult females and 8% of adult males will have cholesterol stones. Cholesterol stones are caused by changes in cholesterol solubility in bile. This may be due to supersaturation of cholesterol or insufficient bile salts to keep the cholesterol in solution. Risk factors for developing cholesterol gallstones include obesity, female gender and increasing age. Other conditions include diabetes, rapid weight reduction and hyperlipidemia and these are examples of risk factors causing cholesterol stones due to excess cholesterol in the bile. Cholesterol gallstones may also arise when there is reduced bile acids in the bile due to malabsorption, for example in cases of cystic fibrosis and Crohn's disease. Back in the days before political correctness, the classic person at risk of developing gallstones was a fat, fair, 40, fertile female. This is a nice example of a large cholesterol gallstone. The surface is faceted and it has also been polished to reveal a rather beautiful lamellated appearance. Around 20% of gallstones are pigment stones and this is caused by excessive secretion of bilirubin. Conditions associated with the development of pigment stones include hemolytic anemia, cirrhosis, ileal resection for example in Crohn's disease, cystic fibrosis, biliary tract infection and parasites such as liver flukes and Ascaris lumbricoides. This gallbladder contains small black stones and these are obviously pigment gallstones. Complications of gallstones include cholecystitis, that's inflammation of the gallbladder, mucosal of the gallbladder, this occurs where the cystic duct is blocked by a stone and mucus collects in the gallbladder because it can't drain out of the gallbladder and this is sterile. Obstructive jaundice, cholangitis and liver abscess formation, pancreatitis and carcinoma of the gallbladder due to the chronic irritation by gallstones. The cystic duct of this gallbladder is blocked by a stone and this has resulted in accumulation of mucus in the gallbladder that has caused it to distend. And this is a mucosal of the gallbladder. This is an example of a gallstone occluding the common bile duct. This is an example of a liver abscess caused by cholangitis due to gallstones. This is a gallbladder where carcinoma has developed. And here is another example of carcinoma of the gallbladder. In this case, this is an advanced adenocarcinoma that is infiltrating into the liver. And you can see the gallstone that has caused it.